one when he thought it wasn't gonna be one. Do hit different we. Who, 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 who? We spin and we slide back with another video. Hey, we got the famous Telly in here. Now, now we can't put no, we ain't gonna put no titles on nothing. Telly, how, how you doing today? I'm doing good, like I always am. <laughs> uh, always good. That's good, that's good. You've been going real viral um, all over the internet lately. Like, a lot of people, we done seen a couple Chicago rappers had your name in their mouth. We done, we done seen a lot. We done seen um, people, baby mamas coming out and speaking against you, um, saying they ready to throw hands. It's, it's just been crazy. Um, and then... We see that you just had a daughter. Congratulations. Um, we do know that you just had a daughter. So first things first, congratulations to you on, on having a, a daughter. Thank you. Thank you for the daughter that you put in me. Okay, Thank it do hit different when J Main put a daughter in you. Okay, topic. Um first things first. Let um this is your first interview. So let's just get right into it. Um where Telly, where are you originally from? Originally from Chicago. The back of the yards. Okay. Fifty um, fourth, right off Damon. Fifty fourth and Damon. Okay. And they call it the back of the yards. Back of the yards, it is. Why they call it the back of the yards? The geographical era. Okay. The area that it is. That's the back of the yards. Oh, that's what they call it. That's what it's called. Just like how I is called the Woodline area in Inglewood, y'all is back of the yards. That's the back of the yards. Okay, it do hit different. Um, Where well, I think it's from, Western. To a little bit past Ashland. A little bit past Ashland. And what was it like growing up over there in that neighborhood in the back of the yards? Exactly what it sounded like, the back of the yards. <laughs> <laughs> so they could get real rambunctious in the back of the yards. Okay. That's another story. You got a story from the back of the yards and had candy. Hmm. It hit different. My story is from the back of the yards and what it is. I mean, I'm I'm here right now, so. Okay. Now, with that being said, um, tell you, Chicago get real treacherous. Um, it's a lot that goes on in Chicago. Um, you know personally, um, we got different friends, but we share one of the same friends, um, Lone Live Bree. Um, so, Ambriana lost her life in Chicago, um, and she was a female um you knew her and i knew her um she was from my hood i believe you went to school with her mm -hmm. um with that being said um how did you survive in chicago like how did, how do you avoid stuff like that because it, it, to other people that's not from chicago that's crazy for a woman to get killed and shot up and then threw out in the alley like in the cold like and it's a snow. lot of stuff is about your attitude, your demeanor, who you grew up around, and what you want out of life. Okay. When you know better, you do better. But half the time, like certain situations like that, it's all in who you know and what you want for yourself. Like me speaking for myself out of out of that situation, we just had two different types of attitudes. Like she was she more outside than I was. Okay. I ain't never been committed to nobody but myself, my kids now, but having to be from somewhere or having to be a person, having to wanting to be or claim by, mm -hmm. that ain't never been my cup of tea. Like, I play the back row. I, I mess with who I mess with. I love who I love, though, but mm -hmm. I know I love myself more than anything. Okay. So to live in the streets and be in the streets is never my first go-to. Okay, so basically, you was you from the back of the yards, but you don't be in all anything that be going on through that neighborhood like that. Like you not in all that BS. We ain't you, never had to be. We ain't never in the back of the yards. We ain't never played like that. Like a woman gonna stay in a woman's place. That it's, makes sense. We always had men that was gonna do what they needed to do if that was what they had to do. But as far as the men that I grew up with, they protected us. We ain't have to worry about no stuff like that. Okay. It's crazy. Um, I know a, a artist um, been buzzing from the back of the yards by the name of Glock Boy Bobo. You know him? Yeah. Um, free, free my, my love, my little love bug. Okay, so <laughs> so he locked up right now. Yeah. Okay. Um, when you said love bug, um, 
go into detail about you and relationship with um, your relation with um, Black Boy Bobo. Because, like, when you, you know, when you grow up with somebody, them, you got your brothers of the hood, you got your babies, them, my babies. Like, mm. I'm older than them, so we all grew up together, but it's like the love that I have for them is like what I just explained. It's like, I ain't never had to be in it with them. Like, it's always been respect, it's always been, you know, exactly what it is. So, to see them doing their thing, getting the recognition that they deserve, doing what it is they like, and just free him till you're free. Look, I know you ain't, you said you, I know you just said you was a little older than Glock Boy Bobo. Um, I know you ain't supposed to ask a woman what's their age, but they, they in the comments, they wondering. Mm -hmm. they, they, how many kids you got? Two. Okay, so can we ask Telly how old Telly is? Or? I'll be 29 this year. You will be 29 this year. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Congratulations. 